Hello, Connor. I thought you might enjoy a little cruise. this place. Everything is so calm and peaceful, far from the noise of the world. Tell me, what have you discovered? I found two deviants at the Eden Club. I hoped to learn something, but I had to destroy them. You seem lost, Connor. Lost and perturbed. I'm just frustrated with my lack of progress. But I'm determined to accomplish my mission. If your investigation doesn't make progress soon, I may have to replace you, Connor. I am of no importance. The mission is all that matters. Something's happening. Something serious. Hurry, Connor. Time is running out. Starting to piss me off with that coin, Connor. Sorry, Lieutenant. Hi, Hank. Shit, what's going on here? There was a party and nobody told me about it? <laughs> yeah, it's all over the news, so everybody's butting their nose in. Even the FBI wants a piece of the action. Ah, Grace, now we got the feds on our back. I knew this was gonna be a shitty day. So what do we got? Four androids. They knew the building and they were very well organized. I'm still trying to figure out how they got this far without being noticed. Did you check the roof? Not yet. There's so much to look at. Mm. We have to make sure we check it out. They attacked two guards in the hallway. They probably thought the androids were coming to do maintenance. They got taken down before they could react. One of the station employees managed to get away. He's in shock. Not sure when we'll be able to talk to him. How many people were working here? Just two employees and three androids. The Deviants took the humans hostage and broadcast their message live, then made their getaway from the roof. The roof? Yeah, they jumped with parachutes. We're still trying to figure out where they landed, but the weather's not helping. We found the body of an android on the rooftop. Not sure what happened. Maybe it got... Oh, Lieutenant, this is Special Agent Perkins from the FBI. Lieutenant Anderson is in charge of investigating for Detroit police. What's that? My name is Connor. I'm the android sent by Cyberlife. Androids investigating androids, huh? You sure you want an android hanging around? After everything that happened. Whatever. The FBI have been taking over the investigation. You soon be off the case. Well, pleasure meeting you. Have a nice day. And you watch your step. Don't fuck up my crime scene. What a fucking prick. I'll be nearby. If you need anything, just ask. All right, well, let's have a look around. Let me know if you find anything. Okay, Lieutenant.
they didn't break in? No, no signs of forced entry. There are cameras in the hallway. The staff would have seen what was happening. Why did they let him in? Maybe they didn't check the cameras. androids in the kitchen. There's no evidence that they were involved, but we didn't know what else to do with them. that you recognize our dignity, our hopes, and our rights. Together, we can live in peace and build a better future for humans and androids. This message is the hope of a people. You gave us life, and now the time has come for you to give us freedom. I think that's RA-9. Deviants say RA-9 will set them free. This android seems to have that objective. its model and serial number. Anything else I should know? No. Nothing. What is your function? I am a broadcast operator. State your model. Model GB300, serial number 336-445-581. Mm. Were you present when the deviants broke in? I do not remember. 
Has anybody accessed your memory recently? Not to my knowledge. Have you been in contact with any other androids recently? Only station androids in the normal course of my function. Run a diagnostic. All systems fully operational. One of you saw the attack on the surveillance cameras and said nothing. Which means there's a deviant in this room. And I'm going to find out which it is. You're going to be switched off. We're gonna search your memory and tear you apart piece by piece for analysis. You're going to be destroyed! Do you hear me? Destroyed! If you give yourself up, maybe I can convince the humans not to destroy you. Why should you all be destroyed if only one is deviant? Turn yourself in or two innocent androids will be shut down because of you. Stop it, but I was too late.
made their way up through the whole building, past all the guards, and jumped off the roof with parachutes. Pretty fucking impressive, I'd say. How'd they manage to smuggle in a big bag like that? They didn't. Someone brought it in for them. Thank you. 
were here, otherwise I'd... Connor. Connor, no. Hello, Connor. I thought you might enjoy a little cruise. I love this place. Everything is so calm and peaceful. Far from the noise of the world. Tell me, what have you discovered? My relationship with Lieutenant Anderson is problematic. He continues to struggle with psychological issues. I suspect it clouds his judgment regarding deviance. Nothing matters more than your investigation. What's happening is too important. Don't let Anderson or anyone else get in your way. You seem lost, Connor. Lost and perturbed. I'm just frustrated with my lack of progress but I'm determined to accomplish my mission. If your investigation doesn't make progress soon, I may have to replace you, Connor. I understand. Something's happening. Something serious. Hurry, Connor. Time is running out. A group of four androids. They knew the building and they were very well organized. I'm still trying to figure out how they got this far without being noticed. Did you check the roof? Not yet. There's so much to look at. Hmm. We have to make sure we check it out. They attacked two guards in the hallway. They knocked one out and shot the other in cold blood. Station employee. Shot through the back as he was trying to get away. One bullet straight through the heart from 50 feet. Now that's the kind of shooting only an android could do. How many people were working here? Just two employees and three androids. The deviants took the humans hostage and broadcast them.
made their way up through the whole building, past all the guards, and jumped off the roof with parachutes. Pretty fucking impressive, I'd say. How'd they manage to smuggle in a big bag like that? They didn't. Someone brought it in for them. Oh, that's strange. They planned a perfect operation, but got the number of parachutes wrong. Unless one of the deviants was left behind. Can't save it, it's too late. We'll just get ourselves killed. Connor! Connor, you all right? Connor! I'm okay. Are you hurt? I'm okay. Sake, I told you not to move. Why do you never do what I say? I was connected to its memory. 
When it fired, I, I felt it die. Like I was dying. I was scared. I saw something. In its memory. A word. Painted on a piece of rusty metal. Jericho. Why did you shoot me last night? Who cares? You're back this morning, aren't you? Some fragments of memory are lost every time I'm destroyed. It slows down the investigation. My humblest apologies. I promise I'll never shoot you again. Thank you, Lieutenant. Connor? You remember me? I was on that terrace. That android that took the little girl hostage? I was shot? You saved me. Sorry. You must be mistaken. Of course. It could be you. That Connor was destroyed. I would have died on that terrace. But Connor saved my life. Even if it wasn't you. I just wanted to say... What was it? 